A very warm welcome to Tech Mining. In previous part of this video we created products set up using interactive report and form page. In this video we will take a deep dive into image handling in Oracle Apex. Open form page 6 in page designer. Modify properties for P6 product image item to map table columns. This mapping is necessary to display product image on details form page. Storage type attribute specifies where uploaded file should be stored, column has to be of data type blob. To show images of selected products on details page, we will create a static content subregion. At runtime images will be added to this region in subsequent step. Sequence is set to place this region before product details region. CSS class image item, references rule you created in previous video to place word Nike in image. Region will be displayed only when there exists an image for a product and this evaluation is made using a condition based on a PL SQL function. Click Product Details Region. Turn off Start New Row property to place this region beside Product Image Region you just added. In this step we will create a new page item to display Product Image in Product Image Region. Right click Product Image Region. Select Create Page Item from Context Menu. Set Properties for New Page Item. Display image item type displays an image stored in a database blob column, or based on an image URL. Style value in custom attributes sets a blue background for image. We also specified database image column and its type. By setting rows returned condition. And using a SQL query we ensured existence of an image in table. An image can be removed from details page and consequently from underlying table by clicking this button. Right click product image region. Select create button. Set properties for new button. It is attached to a process, delete image, configured in next step. At runtime button will appear on top of region.
target value calls a confirmation box. This call is made using an Oracle Apex function, Apex Confirm, by passing a message and name of delete button. If you click yes in confirmation box, process associated with delete button removes image references from products table. This is process we talked about in previous step. It is associated with delete button to remove a product image. Click processing tab. Then right click processing node. Select create process from context menu. Set properties for new process. To remove an image stored in a database table, you are required to just replace content of relevant columns with a null. Sequence is set to place it before close dialog process. This success message will display at runtime. When button press delete image. Processing node contains two more processes, process form product details and close dialog, that were created by page creation wizard. First one is created to handle DML operations. While second one closes page 6 when you click create, save, or delete button. Values of these buttons are mentioned in server-side condition of process, which specifies that dialog is to be closed only when any of these three buttons are clicked. Clicking delete image button won't close page, because name of this button is not in value list. Similarly delete image process will only be executed when delete image button is pressed. That's it. Save your work and click Run Application button. From Main Navigation menu, select Manage Products from Setup menu. On Main Interactive Report page note that Image Detail column is blank at moment, because we do not have any product image in table. This is column which will hold images of products. Click Air Max 2090 link in product column to add image of this product. On product details page, click folder icon representing product image field at bottom of page. This will bring up open dialog box. Go to source code, part 6 folder and select one Air Max 2090 PNG file. Click apply changes button on product details form to save image. Image will appear on interactive report page. Repeat this step to add images of remaining products. After adding all respective images, Click View Icons and View Details options on Interactive Report Toolbar and see Output. Click View Reports icon. Click Actions menu in Interactive Report and select Columns. Make sure all columns, except Description and Last Sold, appear in Display in Report column. You can use arrow icons to arrange columns in a desired order. Click Apply button. Only columns you selected will appear in Interactive Report.
click Actions menu again. Under Report, select Save Report. From Save drop-down list, select as default report settings. Set default report type to primary, click apply. After modifying an interactive report you must save it using this procedure. Each product is presented as a linked icon. If you click any icon, you will be taken to form page, page 6, where you will see details of selected product. Also note remove image button you created appears within this region. Create a new product record by clicking Create button on Products Report page. Open and select any small image file to test image upload. In my case I'm using logo provided in Part 3 folder of source code. You can use any existing product image by right-clicking that image and selecting Save Image As. Once you have an image in place, fill in all fields except price. Try to save this record by clicking Create button. A message price must have some value will appear informing you to provide some value for price. Now provide some alphanumeric value like ABC123 for price. Again a message will come up reminding you to put a numeric value. Finally input a numeric value in price field and save record. You might encounter a primary key violation message while creating first product record. This is because sequence object for this table is created with an initial value of 1. When you try to save first product record, 1 is assigned as first primary key value, which already exists in table. To cope with this situation, just click create button on form page several times. After some clicks record will be saved automatically. You'll see new product appears on products page with image you uploaded among with others. Edit this record and see image. Change category of this product, switch availability to other option and apply changes. Call product again and observe changes you just made to it. Click remove image button and see what happens. Click delete button followed by OK in confirmation box. Product will vanish from list. In next part of this video, you'll explore uploading and viewing PDF and other types of files in interactive report. Thanks for watching.